Here's a Samsung Galaxy A13 smartphone. I'm going to show you two ways how you can perform a factory reset. Okay, the first way would do a soft factory reset, and the second way is a hard factory reset. Now, don't forget with a factory reset, you will lose all your personal information, your photos, your videos, your personal settings, and whatnot. So, hopefully, you already have a backup if that is important. Okay, so we're going to do this for you guys that want a clean slate to start back over, or if you want to resell your A13 smartphone. Okay, so the first way here is a soft factory reset. So what we're gonna do is go into the settings here. So go to your settings right here. And then from here, we're gonna go ahead and scroll all the way up to the very bottom down here. It says about phone, okay? Now you wanna tap on about phone down here and I wanna hide my personal information up there. But from here, the very bottom, it says reset. Tap on reset right there. And now we have over here it says factory data reset. Let's go ahead and tap on that right there. Now take note, okay, so it says all data will be erased from your phone, including your Google account, system app and data, and so on and so on. But if you look down here, this is this is where it's important. It says you are currently signed in a following account, and this is my Gmail address, okay? So because I have my Gmail address synced to this phone. Now, if I scroll all the way up here and I go to reset to do the factory reset, I put in my password and do the factory reset. And then once the factory reset is done and you go back to do the um, your setup, eventually for you to complete that setup, you will need that Gmail um, account uh, email address as well as the password to finish up the setup, okay? So especially if you want to sell the phone, you got to get rid of that uh, Gmail address or... Um, the person you sell it to is not going to be able to complete the setup, okay? So let me show you how to delete that Gmail address, okay? So what we're going to do is just, just go ahead and go back to your settings. Go back to your settings. And then we're going to go from here. What we're going to do is we're going to go to Google Services so we can delete that Gmail. So we're going to go down to Google Services right here. We're going to tap on that right there. And here's my, uh, e my Gmail address right here that I have synced to this phone. And I'm going to tap down here. It says manage your Google account. Tap on that right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and tap on my email address right here, that little down arrow. I'm going to tap on that right there. And I'm going to go to manage accounts on this device right here. We're going to tap on that. And then we're going to tap on our email address up here, our Gmail address. We're going to tap on that right there. And now it says right here we can re remove the account. So we're going to go ahead and remove that account. Remove account. Are you sure? Yes. We're going to click on OK. Okay, and then I need to go ahead and confirm with my password here. And I'll click on done. And voila, it is gone. Okay, so now if we go back into settings and we scroll all the way up and we go to about phone, remember? So tap on about phone. And then again, I'll hide my information up there. But now from here, tap on reset down here. Oops, tap on reset right there. And then we go back to factory data reset. And now you can see it has, doesn't say nothing to do with my Gmail address from here. Okay, so now I can go down to reset, put in my password and my PIN, let it get done the factory reset. And then once the factory re reset is done, I have a clean slate there or I can sell the phone and the person that gets I sell the phone to doesn't need my password to my Gmail account to finish the setup for themselves. Anyway, that's the first way to reset it. That's a soft factory reset. We're going to do a hard factory reset now using the hard keys. Okay, so first thing is we're going to go ahead and turn off the phone, press and hold the power button, and we're going to go ahead and power off. Wait till the phone is completely off. It just vibrated. Phone is completely off. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to press and hold the power button, and then I'm going to press and hold. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm going to press and hold the volume up button. Then I'm gonna press and hold that power button and I'm gonna to continue to hold both buttons until I see the Samsung logo appear. Then I'm gonna let go of both buttons, okay? So we'll do it together, ready? Press and hold volume up, press and hold power button. Now keep on holding, volume up, power. Keep on holding, Samsung logo is there. Go ahead and let go. And then this should boot us up into the Android recovery menu and we can factory reset this way as well, okay? So we can go down to wipe data slash factory reset. So we can go down, fact, White data slash factory reset. Okay, now it's a very important. Look down here what it says down here in red. If your phone is reset, you may need, actually you probably will need to enter your Google account, which is your Gmail, email address and password associated with this phone to be able to use it again. Okay, 
So FYI, all right? So anyway, if you want to proceed with the uh, factory reset, you can tap on the power button here. And this up here is basically saying, once we do this, this cannot be undone, okay? So we're gonna go down here, and we're gonna factory reset again. It's gonna erase everything on the phone. Hopefully, if you have anything important in, on here, you already backed it up. So I'm gonna proceed with factory reset. I'm gonna tap on the power button to continue. Oh, let me focus in. So we're gonna go ahead and do this right now. Boom. Now, give this one second here. Okay, wipe data complete. And then it defaults us back up to here where it says reboot system now. Just go ahead and tap the power button. That's exactly what we want. So we're going to reboot the system now. And now it's going to perform the factory reset. And this whole process will take about two minutes. So just be patient here. It's going to be stuck on the Samsung logo for a while. So just be patient here. And voila, we're done. So now I have a clean slate. I can start everything back over. Or I can also sell it too. Because remember, I deleted my Gmail address on here. Okay. So pretty simple. Questions or issues, just comment below. All right. Good luck, guys. Bye.